Uh, the young lady in the black. Any question? How old are you? If you can, twenty. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, um, how do you deal? What are not deal with? How do you speak up a little bit? How do you go through life knowing that your younger generation is so like hooked up on identity? Like that's what like I feel like my generation like is like makes itself like so full on is in this yeah. identity. Yeah. And I feel like every time like I try to. Uh, like be friends with someone like my age, it's kind of hard because like I feel like I tr truly never know like who someone is, like who they are, like as right. an individual. So she's twenty and she want to know my generation told totally into identity, and she gave these people and they just about this identity thing. How do you deal with them with that? Or just how do you like coexist with it? You know, because everyone I feel like. It's always on eggshells with how they yep. talk about people or how right. they want to be talked about or how they want to be viewed as or called and whatnot. Mm -hmm. You know, the list goes on. Give them the finger. Live your life. No. I feel like that's not what anybody should do. No. What I mean by give them the finger, don't judge them. Yeah. You live your life and you become the living example. Let them have their little identities and act a certain way when you're around them. Just know they cannot help it. Yeah. They're in there, they're angry, they're in their imagination, and they've been told by the world that this is real, that you should act this way. Just know they cannot see, but you live your life. You be a living example. And don't try to impose it on them. Don't try to prove anything to them. You just go through life living that free life, and you're going to come into some of them contact with some of them and they gonna want to know. I noticed that you seem to be different. You're not like afraid or you're not angry or you're not this or that. How did you overcome that? How do you deal with that? You be able to point it back to the source. They will find the light. They will see it in you. But hang out with them if you want, but don't judge them. And don't, and don't try to speak up just to show that you're tough or anything like that. But when asked a question, you just be honest. And then they get mad, don't get mad back. They cannot see. You become the light in, a, in that generation. And the light will leave them. And don't feel sorry for them or anything. Because they love their hell. And they may one day want to wake up. And you'll be able to point them to the source that will wake them up. Yeah. Just be a living example. Quietly be a living example. Enjoy your life when you're around them. Y'all having fun, whatever they're doing. Have fun. But don't you get a sense of identity from it. You're just enjoying it. When you're done with that game, whatever you're done with it, go home and do yourself. And that's it. That's the perfect way of dealing with it. Don't, don't feel sorry for them. Don't be mad at them. They cannot see. That makes sense? Yeah. Because you got to live in the world. you created to live in the world, right? But you got to do it in a wise and a practical way. And you're not going to be able to change anyone. We can't even change ourselves, but we can live amongst them and not judge them. They cannot see. That makes sense? And then, let's say they are for abortion, and I don't want to get into the discussion of abortion, but, but you're not for abortion. If they ask you, are you for abortion? No, I'm not for it. And they want to argue, oh, abortion, little woman, right. Oh, okay, fine. I'm just not for it. Don't argue with the devil. Don't argue with the devil in your mind or outside of you. And they're going to get angry because they can't argue with you, so they can't get a thrill, right? By making you mad, they're going to come after you like 90 going north, don't argue. Yeah, okay, I understand it. You are conservative right wing. Yeah, I might be, but I don't want to push it. Don't try to prove anything. You cannot prove anything to the devil. So don't try it. That makes sense? Yes. And you'll be fine. In your world, you'll be fine. That makes sense? Yeah. That helps? Nice. Good. 